Hello YouTube family, Greg D here, back with another DCUO video, and today I'm going to be bringing you a Celestial DPS guide, loadout, whatever you want to call it. So without further ado, let's get into the power tree here. In the blessed tree, you want three down the middle to get benediction, and then you want three, if I can get over there, three on the right to get down to anoint in your curse tree. You want um, three to the right, and then get your cursed idol, which is... An amazingly awesome supercharge, probably one of the better ones in the game. And then in your iconic tree, you have four left over. So what I did was I got obviously in as with all DPSs, you always want to get your weapons expert and your tactical genius. This helps your uh, increase your chances of critical attacks. And then I went with nano weave armor and powerful resistance, get some health, get some toughness, get some defense. And then your loadout. So get down to there. So you have benediction. Dark Pact, Anoint, Cursed Idol, the Supercharge, Smite, and Retribution. Now, basically, you're going to be using these two powers right here, Smite and Retribution, as your main um, uh, emphasis of damage. These other three powers here, Anoint, Dark Pact, and Benediction, are all going to be your attack buffs. So they're all going to raise your might. They're all going to raise your precision. You want to lay those down first, and then you're going to, like I said, work on getting Smite and Retribution. Now, Celestial is a combo power. So as you can see there, as soon as you first hit the power, you know, in this case, you would hit uh, R2 and, squ and Square. Um, and then as you see there, it says Celestial Combo Tap Melee, which means Tap Square again. So basically what that means is you have a combo power much like uh, Hard Light or uh, Atomic is, for example. So all you do is you hit the power and then you tap melee again and see it, it gives you like that extra little combo move. Now for um, the other one, Retribution, you tap melee, tap range. So basically you want to hit the power then you go that, then you go that, and see, there you go. Now, um, so... It's really, this loadout is really, really simple. Um, uh, in this case, though, because as you saw, there are a lot of white ticks, you want to spec out to mostly precision, if not all precision, um, with Celestial, with Hard Light, with Sorcery, anything like that. Uh, Celestial is definitely something that you want um, your precision to be as high as possible so you can get the highest white ticks possible and therefore keep your damage up um, so basically with the rotation it's very very simple you just basically want to like i said lay down your uh, attack buffs and then get into the combos now um, i'm not the greatest at the combos it takes some muscle muscle <laughs> some muscle memory so um you know practice with it get some time with it um and eventually, you know, you'll build up that muscle memory so that you're good. So basically, let's just go through, hit your attack buffs, smite, whoops, see, I even can't do it right. There it is. See, ah, there, oh, and I screwed it up that time too. There it is, see, not too bad. So once again, hit your attack buffs. Bam. Now, it's it's funny because Celestial, at one point, when they did um, buff it with the advanced mechanic, was probably the a little bit OP. It probably was the best DPS power at the time. Um, right now, it probably falls somewhere in the middle. Um, but as you can see there, if you have precision specced out really high, much like the other powers, you know, using the advanced mechanic, if you have the might, and if you're specced out all might, the better chances you'll have, I guess I should say, of... Um, hitting high numbers and this is the, no, no different except with precision the more precision you have the better the chance is that you'll hit really high numbers so once again let's just go through hit your attack buffs and then you work on the combos and as you can see i'm hitting for you know six thousand five thousand so i mean maybe not as it's like it's not as um powerful as let's say like atomic was with one hit but over time, this power can do very, very well. So I hope this helped you guys out. Uh, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe if you would like to see more DCUO videos or gaming videos in general. Um, and until next time, we'll see you guys soon.